Well, AMD's on a roll. Firstly, they're about to release the very first CPU with 3D vCache, that being the 5800X3D later in April. And now a brand new set of leaks suggests that they'll be releasing not one, not two, but three new graphics cards in May. And one of them will be the new flagship, the Radeon RX, 6950 XT. That alongside two more 50 XT graphics cards will be AMD's attempt to try and become more relevant in this generation before the start of the next one later this year. Are they going to be able to beat the competition with this? Well, uh, let's be honest, no one knows so far. Seeing how this information is still pretty fresh like some delicious homemade garlic bread, we don't know too much about how well they're going to perform. What we do know, however, is that these cards are gonna ship with not the 16 gigabit per second GDR6 memory as previous RX 6000 cards, but instead, they're gonna come with 18 gigabit per second GDDR6X memory. That in its own is gonna result in over 12% more memory bandwidth for these brand new cards. And seeing how the 6900XT already has 16 gigs of VRAM, that is going to be a lot of memory that your favorite games are going to be able to use. Not to mention the fact that that kind of fast memory is also going to help you a lot in productivity workloads as well. But is it going to be enough to beat Nvidia? Well, only time would tell. But even if these brand new AMD graphics cards will be able to defeat the beast that is Nvidia's Ampere, well, Nvidia Lovelace is already on the horizon, so many people will probably just wait and grab those instead, or maybe whatever AMD will provide with their next generation cards as well. But whatever, more options in the GPU market is always nice. Let's just hope they won't get roasted as badly by the community as at one time they released a graphics card in 2022 with just 4 gigs of VRAM. But let me know what you think of this down in the comments below. I'm very curious to hear what you guys think of these new AMD graphics cards. And hey, if this video wasn't too boring for you, then maybe consider checking out our Patreon down in the video description below because even just one single dollar month truly goes a long way while well, you get awesome perks as well. I'd also love to thank my existing patrons Gavin Burns, Ryan, OKB, Meg Sumner, Shane Orcroft, Lansby and Jesse Herman. Thank you guys so so much support truly goes a long way. Down there you're also going to find our merch store, our discord server and our social media links as well. But anyway that's about it so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did then remember to subscribe, like, whatever and I'll see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye everyone. Good. Bye. <laughs>